we're just sitting here in a little mid-afternoon snack. We get a lot of questions about what we kind of pack for food throughout a day. Trail and I are on a 10-day backcountry elk hunt right now. So usually what I like to start off with, it's around like 10 o'clock. I'm not a big breakfast guy. Kind of a mid-morning snack is the Pro Bar base, which gets me through till about lunch. I'll do a bag of jerky. I like the green belly meal to go. This has a ton of calories. It has 640 calories, so this is a really good one to pack it in. Tuna and a tortilla. Pretty simple, good calories, tastes good. So then I kind of get a good mixture of, you know, bar and meat texture. Honey stinger with a Justin's vanilla almond butter. And I usually like a different flavor for these, like chocolate, vanilla. The plain ones where you just do like almond butter or just plain peanut butter, they're good, but I'd recommend doing like vanilla, caramel, chocolate, one of those. And then kind of some energy throughout the afternoon to keep me going or anytime I'm feeling kind of tired, these are kind of my three energy things that I like to bring. And these are the Pro Bar Bolt. They have some caffeine in it and then also a little honey stinger gel, which is good for a little energy boost. And then for dinner, one of my all-time favorite, this is the old chicken and mashed potatoes. Little treat, little dessert to end the night. Just another honey stinger with some uh, vanilla almond butter. So which you is, carry two of those. I two, carry two, two stingers, two almond butter. Oh yeah, one yeah. for one for during the day, and then a little dessert right before I go to bed. Right on. All right, trail dig um, in. What do you got? I'm pretty similar. I'm not a big breakfast eater either, so um, this is typically uh, my breakfast, which is mid morning, maybe nine or ten o'clock which is just a pro bar, uh, meal bar, peanut butter chocolate chip. Um, midday snack, I also go with the honey stinger, just a honey, honey stinger. Uh, lunchtime for me, uh, some salami, uh, cheese packets, getting a little discolored at this point. I was say, dude, that looks a little, you little could, ripe. You could still eat it. <laughs> I've eaten these like 11 days in. Have you? Yeah. The cheese gets a little sweaty, but hey. it tastes great. It looks great. Going along with lunch, some Fritos, high in calories, super lightweight. These are the barbecue uh, twists. Oh, yeah. Some mule deer jerky from the buck that my kid killed this last fall. Uh, and then maybe, I don't know, 40 or 50 almonds. Uh, I'm of the opinion that uh, if you don't eat it, you shouldn't pack it. <laughs> so Snickers, I know I'm always gonna eat those. And I can tell you that if a day's been long and hard, you've done a bunch of hiking, nothing tastes better than a Snickers. It's also got a bunch of calories. I mean, it's only uh, under two ounces and you're into that 250 calories. So some chocolate's great, 230 calories. 230 calories. I, I correct, I stand corrected. See, it's good to go hunt with a trail because then you can trade with him all the time. That's right. He's got all the goodies. These little, that's it, fruit bars, it's just dried fruit. So within that, you get one apple, one banana. They also make mango ones, they make cherry ones, they make blueberry ones. Uh, that will just help keep you regular if you need a little fiber in your diet. Uh, flat bagel. And then uh, this is a little peanut butter packet. This is the RX nut butter, which is my favorite. You get one egg white, 18 almonds, half a date, and no bullshit. Well, yeah. it says BS, but no BS. Uh, very delicious. Um, oh, this is a little, a little tip. Uh, I like these little energy packets. This is you just get these at Walmart or wherever. Uh, it's just a little caffeinated peach mango that you can mix in your water. You can see that I'm having a little mid-afternoon pick-me-up in my Coke bottle. And then for dinner tonight, Mountain House uh, looks like spaghetti. Uh, another pro tip. <laughs> uh, I cut the tops off all my Mountain Houses. I mean, you're probably only shaving like 0.25 ounces, but hey. Nice. I clip that off. I love then, ripping it off. Do you? Just like, well, I, used oh. to, I still get to rip it off. Oh. But I cut I cut above the rip. Okay. So you still rip it. So I'm cutting off like this much of each one. I got you. Packs better. It does pack better. Smaller. That's it for me. Go team. Go team. That's kind of our backcountry food that we like to bring with us. Seems to work. Trail's been doing this for God knows how long. A while. <laughs> 20 years maybe. This is about the same, I, st I stick pretty much with the same system. You just get what works for you and stay with it. Run with it. Swag. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>